Hey guys, I had a minus list today and I thought I'd showcase vaginoscopic method of um, doing hysteroscopy. Um, I had a lady who was seeing me for postmenopausal bleeding and was being investigated for the same. And as you can see, oh, we have now uh, put the hysteroscope in the vagina and um, essentially all we're doing is looking around the vagina i go posteriorly first and um, have a look around and then uh, while i you know go ahead anteriorly um, i figure out where the cervix is and as you can see over here we're finally seeing um, the cervix and that's the external loss and we're trying to negotiate our way through it without using undue force or trauma um, now you can see that there are some adhesions um, at the um, os which um, do not let us go inside the cavity and um, essentially all you need to do to avoid um, a false passage or a perforation in hysteroscopy is to constantly negotiate by moving forwards and backwards um, so that you get an overall sense of where exactly you are and um, so that you don't go um, where you don't want to. <laughs> Um, so you can see that um, there are two kind of um, holes over here on the right and left and um, there's a septum in between um, probably because of uh, menopause and we're trying to negotiate with hydrodilation we're persisting on one side and there you have it those adhesions are just broken down by hydrostatic force alone and then um, you just drop your hand uh, a bit further down and negotiate your way slowly further in and voila we're in the cavity um, so once you're in the cavity, you assess uh, both the ostea, you see the left ostea, you turn around 180 degrees and then you see the right ostea. And now you pan back so that you get a panoramic view of the entire cavity. And overall, it seems quite atrophic. I don't see any obvious polyp or thickened endometrium. And now you slowly, you know, um, pan back um, so that you get an overall view. And um, there you have it. That's it. Um, the vaginoscopic method of hysteroscopy. Um, thank you for watching, guys. Stay tuned for more videos. Bye bye.